Hello everybody and welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West where I can't keep track of how many takes I've tried uh, to do the intro to this, but welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West. Uh, it's been almost two months since I've played. Uh, I have looked at what I need to do. Uh, once again though, you'll have to forgive me um, as per usual with this with this game and like the big games that I do in general when I can't record very often. I'm gonna suck at it. I don't get to improve in games, I just get to sort of uh, stay a constant um, mediocre. <laughs> but um, anyway, I have decided uh, I'm just gonna roll. Essentially, I'm gonna finish my friend's quest, I'm gonna finish the second verse and what was lost, that's for Catalo, and then I'm gonna do the main quest. I have been just very overwhelmed with all of the side quests and all of the collection things, and as much as I would love like a cool new set of armor and stuff, I I just can't anymore. I can't with it, and I believe I actually ran into this in Horizon Zero Dawn as well, which doesn't surprise me, um, but I'm surprised it didn't happen almost sooner with this game, I guess, because this game has so much more, and I guess I was feeling pretty overwhelmed for a while and just took a break, whereas in Horizon Forbidden West, I was like, all right, we're going. Um, I would love to come back someday, like I, like I said I would do for Horizon, for, uh, Horizon Zero Dawn, come back and do a lot of these collectible stuff, um, which I did end up doing a lot of it uh, on a live stream, but I never ended up putting that on YouTube, but that is the first game I think I ever platinumed on PlayStation, so, uh, close to my heart. Anyway, we're gonna finish, apparently, last time we had not finished Zoe's quest yet, so we're gonna go meet her at Plain Song. Did I, I think I removed stuff? Sorry, did I remove stuff from... Nope. That's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> uh, did I... Or am I just... I'm just blind. Oh, it's outside of Plain Song. See, I'm so sorry. I'm gonna be... I'm gonna be a big time noob on this. But yes, no, I just decided that, um... I would just like to finish the game. It's been over a year since it's been out, and I, I feel like I've stalled long enough almost. You know what I mean? Like, not like, in, I mean, kind of intentionally, because I really do enjoy all, it's, the side quests are very meaningful to me. Like, honestly, like, I've, I think I've felt more on those than I have on anything else. Plus, I'm honestly just ready to be filled with rage at Ted Farrow. I'm ready. I'm ready for it. Um, let's see if I can even, I, I am not going to remember how to do anything. Um, sorry, I am gonna try what is it like uh, using the workshop bench so that I can get my ammo remade without being too expensive um, but yeah honestly I've been a little upset with the way combat like the way I can't really do combat the way I want to um, so that's been part of the reason also that I've been like mm, I don't know I don't know if I want to you know, do it, because it's not as satisfying as I would like it to be. Um, but here we are. We're gonna finish it up. Where's my trap? There we go. But yeah, I just kind of feel like I owe it to you guys and to myself, to the game, essentially, to, uh, to finish things up. So, and like, potentially, you know, run around and doing other things. Where'd she go? Uh, but... Oops. I gotta remember how to press buttons. Um, but yeah, I just kinda wanna get the main stuff done so that it that stops awesome. hanging over my head. I do vaguely remember that the San Francisco, because we're gonna be going to San Francisco for this, for Ted Farrow anyway, um, that there is there is still a point where we don't, like the end game is not, So's back. At, it's, you have like a break point. What is she doing to law? After San Francisco. Should we stop her? Aloy, you made it. Like, before, like, the end game approaches. All of the land gods have been updated. Now to send out the reboot signal. They're gonna think she's, like, a god speaker or something. <laughs> this is cool. I know this isn't, like, the the final solution, but I'm really glad we can do this. Ah, that person faded in. 
singing. <gasps> the singing. Is what that this mean? is that why they have the name? A new beginning. Gaia told me this would happen to all of them. Do, T, So, and the rest. She called it a reboot sequence. But I didn't think it would be so beautiful. And for the Utaro to do this. Soon the land gods will return to tilling the or to hear it. They, once did. they are a music people. So, the chorus wants a word. Yeah, of course they I'm do. sure they do. Do you want me to come? No need. I'm ba I'll just tell them that the lands will soon be. I want to come and watch. Ready to argue. Find me later, and I'll tell you how it went. I want to. I want to watch. This is the other thing that, and I know I've already mentioned this, but. Okay, there. So I did not even think about it, but there has to be like an origin and why their name, like the naming convention, right? Like we've talked about it before in like several video games, and I think in this one too, where like there's always a grain of truth. There's always something in a story that, like, even if it's been like exacerbated or like like manipulated or like used out of control, you know, like like what is it like uh, contorted out of control potentially? There's always like a grain of truth in why something is the way like why a story is the way it is and so i didn't even think about it i thought maybe like you know the, the utaru are like singing people so they named their gods but like how did they know the dore folk like so whatever whatever you know there has to have been something in the way they were raised where they got like an inkling of that from their like whatever those like crash or whatever the little nurseries are essentially that they were in like way way back that has like followed them through to this and that's probably why they're singing people like why they appreciate singing so much and why they base so much of their culture and like their i mean the, the main governing body is called the chorus and like you know the people sing if they want to like have something you know addressed you know like oh my gosh it all ties together that's super beautiful sorry i'm trying to find the menu that's really really cool um so now we will do where is he at? Oh my goodness, he's so he's so way over there. Did I? Did I? <laughs> oh, okay, I'll go here. I was like, did I go there? I don't remember going there. Uh, this is also the problem with playing for so long for like a year is that like you kind of forget some things. But I'm sure when I get there, I'll be reminded, or not. I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. It would be nice to go look at. I should go check out the face painters. Because I do have some new face paints. And I got a new Otaru one just now, which I do like. And Birth Singer is very appropriate for what we just did, right? This is where the Zenith Lab is. Oh, the that's Tom right. He thinks he can find what he needs to build that's himself a right. new in there. That's right. I remember now. I should try contacting him. Let him know I'm here. Yeah. That's right. That's right. Hey, Katalo? I'm at the Zenith Lab. Ready to come over? I'm on my way. I was gonna say, the other thing I want to complain about is that I don't get to see my friends often enough, and I was really thinking I was gonna be able to. Aloy. I appreciate you. I love you! I'm happy to help. <laughs> Did Gaia mention where exactly in the Zenith Lab we'd find what you need? She mentioned the chamber where you found Beta, and the database that lies within. She said it'll help us find the knowledge and components I require to build a new arm. At least we know where to look. We will have to be quick about it, in case the Zeniths are watching. Understood. Maybe I should look up and see if the other companions the labs up this have way. a quest, actually, that I need to trigger in some way. Let's go! Kote's pumping himself up, let's go. And he's gotta climb one, one armed. I know people do it, like, but it's definitely harder. You okay? I got this. Don't ask him that. I did just mess with the volume. If something is, I'll hopefully notice it in editing. But uh, I turned Machines. myself down a bit. We're scrapping the specters for parts. Don't eat that. You don't know where that's been. Can we dispose of them? Or we can sneak past you them. You don't know where that's been, no Machines. Choice. Oh, well, let's just sneak past. I don't want to deal with this. Or or we could just use the giant gun over here. Let's just go. If they're that easy to sneak past. Oh, just kidding. There's a giant... What does this do? Stalker dart gun? 
watch. I'm just I'm just going. We're going ham here. Oh wait, can we just uh, drop this? I guess Hephaestus was busy making hunter killers. Oh, okay. I was like, what do you mean? I already know what that is. But all right, let's just sneak past it. It's easier. Wait, where am I going up? I'm going up. It's an apex thing, and I kind of want to save my. I did build a bunch of traps and whatnot, so I would like to save my resources. Maybe if I make a build that the game actually appreciates, like a melee arrow build, I'll enjoy it more, but... The anime did this? Hard to believe, but yeah. Or, I just look up a guide. Maybe there's a guide that'll tell me how to be better. How to get good scrub, you know? Uh, is it that way? <laughs> I tried to climb on the uh, Listen, I would love to climb on the but Anyway, slap, slap my hand. No, don't say things like that. <laughs> this is for public viewing. <laughs> um. Enemies up ahead. Oh my gosh. Fire's wasted on that machine. Oh my gosh, they're all apex creatures. There we go. Having a hard time. I mean, I could. What do I have here? Nope. How do I? There. I could not. I was like, how? Oh, nope. Don't look. I would like to just make these things go berserk. Battle it is. Let's teach them respect. Oh my gosh, do no. Oh my gosh, I should have known better. Oh, whoa! Oh no, no, that's not what I wanted you to do. Oh my gosh, this is all going very poorly. Hang on. I need... nope. Okay, stand up. You have to finish them! Oh. oh my gosh, he just absolutely destroyed it. Amazing. Use this opportunity! Now, finish it! We better get a move on. The room we found Beta in is up ahead. I'm definitely gonna Need regret to using that. I'm trying to get back up top, but I can't see anything. I should turn the lights off in my room. Um, also, I hope the... Um, the video is good. I need to put this in verbally so I remember. Um, I cha I messed with the bitrate, and I had it way, way, way low. Like, to the minimum, like, mi absolute minimum. And I was like, eh, I don't know if I want to do that. And I remember originally it was a little higher, so I put it at 10 because the internet was very conflicted on, like, what's a good, just for, like, 1080p, 60 frames per second, recording, like, you know, I'm here. Fight with honor. Um... I, like I'm, I'm, just, I'm a small time operation. I'm not looking for like 4K, what, 180 frames per second, whatever. You know what I mean? Like I'm not looking for like super, super high quality, but I want to have high quality stuff. Like I want to have good quality stuff. So I'm messing with the, with the bit rate and I am messing a little bit with the volume. 
Because bitrate to me is more of a streaming thing, so I, but it does it does affect. Anyway, it affects other things. I'm not gonna go into it because that's boring. Um, but I didn't realize it was so low. So, but I remember now vaguely. Like I was looking at the settings and I was like, oh yeah, I remember doing that. Is that it down there? Yep. We better make our way down there. Uh, I don't trust none of this. Why is he... Why is he glowing? I don't... Glowing... He's like glowing purple. Everybody don't... People don't usually glow purple. Oh, should I just jump? Okay. Cool, I'm just gonna... Yeah, just gonna throw myself down into an arena? Awesome. We're here. I'm trying to remember how to glide. Now we just need to find a way to access the database guy was talking about. All we're here. What? Why? I jumped down. You could do it. See, again, I really, I really was thinking it like, from I don't usually watch promotional material for stuff because I don't want to get one of those like, pods. I would hate to be locked up inside such a thing. Yeah, you wouldn't do well in there. There's you, barely room to breathe. You came down. You said you were going to stay up there. Um, anyway, I was really hoping to have more, like, option to bring companions out. I could definitely see how it would be a pain, but just having the option, you know? But I guess then again, you do have to worry about, like, balance. I guess you'd have to, like, either have a companion or not. Like, they'd have to script it in that you did or you didn't, because otherwise balancing stuff would be really difficult, maybe? I don't know. I feel like they, some games do it, though. I don't know. I think I found what we're looking for. Let's hope it holds the answers we seek. Dude, you're gonna look sick with a prosthetic. We're gonna 3D print him an arm. I'll download the database to your focus, so you can search through it later. What about the components? They should be somewhere on the... Spectres! For the fallen marshal! Oh my goodness, where? Oh, I should've... I should have... Set up. I am a weapon! Shut up. I should have set up traps before that because I knew how this was gonna go. Come on up here. Do it. Yeah, run on up here. I don't even remember what's good against these guys. Meat versus acid. I don't have good weapons for this. I like it right currently equipped. Oh. oh my gosh, I don't know how to do this. Honestly, I'm not equipped. Oh boy. Ah! To deal with two of these things? Last time I was smart. Oh. And I set up because I knew they were coming. Why we have grab points somewhere? They're only weak to acid and plasma, and they can just jump like maniacs. So, like, This I, I equipped elemental fury, which should oh that's not what what the heck why did I know I wanted this it's burning itself away. Uh, I need better arrows. And I have this one behind me. Let's put. Yeah, uh -huh. oh my gosh. Still breathing. Yeah, am I still breathing? I don't know. 
see, I am just, I am not equipped for milling and stuff. Do you need help? Yeah, I do. I'm dying. That was all I had. Oh, I need you to. Yeah, okay. Because when the ammo, when the armor is down. I'm still a marshal, and we'll die a uh... Oh, it's down. Oh, do the critical hit, you maniac. I can't, can't do it. I am just. I'm hoping to knock his guns off. What is that? Oh, oh, okay. Nope, okay. Well, I knocked something off. And a one on back. And we're still too much for you. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh my gosh, Aloy, oh. I, okay, she drank it, that's good. Please drink it. Oh, she's not drinking it. Why not? Good. Okay, there we go. Better. I can't, I can't even see their attacks half the time. Zenus might send reinforcements. We need to finish up and get out of here. So expensive. The components should be somewhere on the second floor. I'm right behind you. Listen, first, we are looting these guys. Again, I'm not actually 100% sure if like the acid and blast, like blast stuff, is a good combo. But the acid's supposed to eat away through the armor, so I figure blasting stuff should be really good to do when the armor's down. You know? Okay, something about it being up here somewhere. Is that what she said? It was nice having Kotalo. Uh, I think I would not have been able to do this without him, honestly. Oh, I should. I don't have any medicinal berries. That's awesome. Love that for me. Is this easy? Hopefully that was it. Because <laughs> I think that was like the first time ever that I've used health potions. How up? We need to search the entire floor. I'll keep a lookout. Don't want any more surprises. Oh my gosh. See? Idea. They're not being, I mean, he's like ostensibly being helpful, but nope, wrong button. This also infuriates the fact that I have to do that. The fact that I have to use that thing at all. Um.
A vent. Might be a way out of this room. Can I open this or is it? Hello. Oh, look at this. Like protective gear. Where is she see oh Oh come on Let me up Please tell me the components are in there In the vent? Yeah, they're in the vent. I think she means the room, but <laughs> the timing was uh suboptimal. Break? No? Okay. Am I going in, going in circles? There's like multiple routes that I've seen out of the corner of my eye. Did I just go back in a circle? I I can't tell. The components have to be here somewhere. Okay. Just stand up. Hmm. I thought I saw something through, like, glitch through the wall for a second. Another... A purple chest or something. Oh! Explode- yeah, I did! Ha ha! The game is walls aren't always, uh, 100%. Which is fine, like, I'm not gonna nitpick. Gotcha. I think it's funny. Oh! I should go back and give these to Kotalo. Yeah, well, but what's the... Oh, this is the way out. Okay. I think these are stunningly beautiful. All of the things that they have for the, the like, up. restricted stuff. Oh, no, I, I tried to get out of the way, but I didn't go fast enough. Like the mushroomy, like the stone mushroomy things almost. They're really beautiful. The vines and stuff. Katalo, are you still alive? You've been eaten by uh, the future people who are the past people, actually. You found the components? See for yourself. You have my thanks, Aloy. Something wrong? I love you. I was <laughs> just thinking about what it will be like after I build the arm. Will I feel different? Whole again? <sighs> Idle thoughts. They can wait until we're back at base. You go on ahead. I might want to take one more look around, in case there's anything useful. Very well. I look forward to putting what we found to good use. Walk with <laughs> he the smiled. He smiled at me. He just he just smiled at me. We're married. Uh, yeah, no, I don't care what's in there. I don't, I don't care what's in here. We're gonna go straight back to the base. Let's see, can I... Give me out. Give me out, give me out, give me out. Also, hopefully, um... What's her name is there? So, and she can be like, I gave him what for? Gangster style. You know, how Zoe talks. <laughs> I really do, I love the characters that they made in this game. I think all, even like this, like the, like little side quest ones in particular, like that flowers one with the purple flowers between like the Tanakh woman and the, um, Utaru man and the... Osram woman with the quest with her brother, like those two in particular, made me sob like a baby, like a wee baby. I think unless there's like this like hops into a cutscene, I'm actually gonna. Okay, awesome. Um, I'm actually gonna call this one here because it is a little bit getting a little bit long. Um, since we did Zo, a little bit of Zo's and most of Catalo's. So we'll hop in and see what's up with Catalo after this. I think I will look up and see if, um, oh my gosh, my other friends whose names escape me. Oh my gosh, I'm such a terrible friend. <laughs> I'm going to look up and see. Uh, I'm worried that the Osram, like, my kid's name is right there. But uh, I'm worried that his is involving the bandit camps. And if that's the case, too too bad, buddy. Buddy old pal. Sorry about that. Um, and my other friend, who's been my friend for a long time, <laughs> who's from my tribe, um, I, I am drawing a blank. I 
I have like so much information on them except their names right now. Um, but his might have just been like when he was with me at the beginning, but I'll double check. Um, but thank you all so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Again, thank you. If you have gotten this far, I appreciate you waiting this long. Hopefully from here, I'm not going to like book it or like, you know, ignore things, but I, I am going to I'm going to focus now I'm mostly on the main mission and like important things like that. So thank you all for waiting and for watching this. I really appreciate it. And really quick, I want to say thank you to my patrons, to all my patrons, but to especially Risky Lido, my sapling tier patron. Thank you so much for your support. And Adam, my other sapling tier patron. Thank you so much for your support. I appreciate you both a bunch. And I want to give an extra special shout out to Christopher, my tree tier patron, who is the super bestest and who I super appreciate all your support. I really, really do. It means a lot. So thank you guys again for watching and I hope to see you in the next one.